Oh my god, it's already 8.45 in the morning. Okay. It's time for us to leave. Alice! Hey Alice, come! Let's leave. It's your exams, final day of the exams and we better be on time. Alice said, yeah mama, I'm coming. Uh, as we both got into the car, I could see, sense an eerie sense of silence. Okay. It was very different from our usual mornings where we would smile at each other and, and uh, um, get into a breezy chat about what's going on in school and who's dating whom and all those uh, small little gossips that usually go around in school. Okay. As I could see, she was barely talking to me and she was even barely making any eye contact. Um, definitely there was tension in the air. You know, there, was, uh, there was an eerie silence. Okay. And uh, I could see that she was breaking into a cold sweat. And she could see that I was breaking into a cold sweat. What about me? What's, what's it about me? Was it that it was a, a big exam for her? Why was I getting a little tensed as well and uptight as well? Um, as we, uh, as we, as we uh, uh, progressed, I could see that uh, Alice was also twitching, her twiddling her thumb, okay, biting her nails, and she was fidgeting around uh, nervously. Uh, uh, as I <coughs> drove to school, uh, I was just uh, trying to uh, change the mood and tempo and trying to speak to her and uh, I went about you know, uh, touching, giving her that reassuring touch and asking her, hey Alice, is something wrong? Is everything okay? And uh, uh, she was like trying to change the topic and uh, there was a chips packet on the dashboard and as she opened it she, and you could hear the cracking sound of the the chips uh, packet and uh, she started uh, eating uh, furiously and as she opened the packet you could s the uh, air was filled with uh, the <laughs> what aroma how do you describe the chips aroma the aroma of hot potato chips uh, and uh, so I, I, you know, uh, I've heard that people kind of get into this binge eating when they get nervous. So I was like telling her, Alice, it's okay, do your best. You know, uh, whatever you do, uh, we're still there. So uh, Alice felt a little better. Uh, but I was getting a little distracted by the fact that she was still uh, very nervous. And uh, I could smell that something was wrong. Okay, I could smell trouble. As I was getting distracted, I hardly paid attention to the road. And as I turned towards the road, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, there was a van, there was a van, stop, stop, press the brake, press the brake. Uh, I think I mistook for the, uh, mistook the brake for the accelerator and the car was going boom. Okay. The car went room ahead and, and it was like too late and finally I pressed the brake, the brake gets jammed and I could, you know, so much jammed, I pressed so much of pressure that, uh, I can I can feel the smoke coming out of the brakes, you know, uh, jamming. Okay. And uh, I have no choice. Finally, my car absolutely rammed into the stationary vehicle, and I closed my eyes and I prayed, "God, be saved." And that was the final thing that I I, I saw or I, I felt. After a while, someone comes and wakes me up, sprinkles water on my eyes. <laughs> 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 <It's insane. laughs> Are you all right? That's it. <laughs>